scoreless through seven innings and down by five. Pepperdine making a thrilling comeback, defeating BYU 8-7 after a walk-off single from Aaron Barnett. Down by five, the Waves wouldn't score until the bottom of the eighth tonight. Pepperdine turned things around quick when Aaron Barnett got things going with a two-run single, putting the blue and orange on the board 5-2. A swinging bunt and Brandon Caruso beats everyone to first, making it a 5-3 game. A fly out to left ends the inning, but not before Pepperdine scores five runs to tie things up heading into the ninth. BYU would answer back, scoring two runs in the top of the ninth to go back up 7-5. Colton Yamaguchi with the home run, Pepperdine not giving up at all this game. He put another run on the board for the Waves. Pepperdine trails 7-6 with one out. Waves would load the bases, including this bunt single from Brad Anderson. The rest is history. Let's take a look at the last play to end the game. Barnett bringing in two more runs for the Waves. Pepperdine wins it in dramatic fashion 8-7 scoring eight runs in the final two innings. The walk-off waves will keep things alive in WCC play on Friday, where they will take on LMU at 3.30. I mean, everyone was doing a great job battling at the end there. They knew that the game wasn't over. Um, guys are finding a way on base, and like in the last inning, that was a perfect example. You know, we got one out there after Colton's home run, which was huge, and then right away, guys on base, on base, and you know, they got the bases loaded, and it makes it a lot easier as a hitter to have that situation. You know, it, uh, it's kind of like I've told other people, you know, you play nine innings, and we had some great at-bats going in through most of the game. Uh, we just couldn't get it to hit when we needed it to kind of break some things open, break the ice a little bit. And then, uh, you know, then we finally start getting some hits, and we take advantage of some mis mistakes that they made, just like they did with us. And so from that point out, it was just now it was just a matter of, like, who could get to the finish line the quickest, and we were fortunate to do that.